Hey there, green thumbs. Tired of seeing your prized plants being overtaken by those cotton candy-like pests? Yup, you got it. Today we're talking mealybugs. How to get rid of them. Stay tuned. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe, share this video with your fellow garden enthusiasts, and drop a comment below about your worst mealybug nightmare. Let's dive in. But first, what are the things you'll need to complete this task? For the full list and where to get them, check the description and pinned comment below. Now that you have all your tools and materials ready, let's get into it. Get rid of it! You know, I bet when you pictured your peaceful, lush, green indoor jungle, the last thing you imagined was a swarm of pesky mealybugs staging a coup, right? Now these tiny insects look innocent enough, all white and fluffy, but don't be deceived. They're sap suckers. They love your plant's juicy goodness. And trust me, they don't believe in sharing. Alright, time to declare war on these invaders. But, how? A fascinating study from the University of California's Integrated Pest Management Program, released back in 2018, found that, and listen to this, a simple solution of water, dish soap, and isopropyl alcohol can do the trick. Sounds like something out of your kitchen, doesn't it? So, go grab a spray bottle, fill it with a cup of water, a teaspoon of dish soap, and a tablespoon of isopropyl alcohol. Shake that up, and you've got yourself a homemade mealybug terminator. Now, how to use this stuff? Simple. Just spray it directly onto the mealybugs and any white, cottony residue you see on your plant. But, remember, we don't want to drown our beloved green babies, so go easy on the spraying. The soap and alcohol work together to dehydrate the bugs and send them off to bug heaven. Maybe you're thinking, hey, what about my outdoor garden? Good question. There's a beneficial bug out there called the mealybug destroyer, Cryptolemus montrugieri. Sounds epic, right? According to a study by the Agriculture and Natural Resources, University of California in 2019, these little predators can eat mealybugs for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Introducing a few into your garden can help keep the mealybug population in check. And finally, prevention. That's the real key, isn't it? Always check new plants for any signs of mealybugs before bringing them home. According to plant pathologist Marjorie Daughtry in her study at Cornell University in 2020, quarantining new plants for a couple of weeks can save the rest of your plant family from a mealybug invasion. And there you have it. You're now armed and ready to kick some mealybug butt. Remember, the key to healthy plants is observation, good care, and a bit of bug knowledge. Share your mealybug battles in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video to help other green thumbs out there. Until next time, keep those plants happy and mealybug free.